Well, hello everybody. Today we'll be playing some more Undertale. Um, Undertale. I forgot what the game is called. Undertale Judgment Hall. Oh, Judgment Day. And today we're going. We're going to be do, doing the new event that is as found with gas stuff. If you click on it, he says this. This next experiment will be very, very interesting. Wouldn't you agree? If you press yes, they're waiting for you. John header one. He will say your name, and then this. You can go the if, if you want to, but anyway. This is a new event including sands or passive sands where you will fight them and then you can have two different endings. The mercy and the fight and the fight ending. Today I'll be showing you how to get the mercy ending and I might do a video about how to get the um how to get the um fight ending, but he's very hard. So if you go through the store, you find sands. And you saw the runa 99 HP. But here is the problem with this fight. It's very, not to say glitchy, but it's very, it's hitboxes are a bit off. You see, you got to hit him like that. Yeah, he has a few misses, but like he got, he got the bone wave. Let's bone attack, you do that. Run around, you miss him again. He does that, you miss him. Do that. Hey, yeah, uh, so I don't know. If you noticed, but I'm pretty busy. So then, he does different patterns like number one, number two. Num I appreciate if you made this fast. So number one, number two. So this is a guide on how to, on how to dodge some of his attacks. So I think every phase is a few phases. So now he does the bone wave, a bone, and then two of these. So that's how that attack works. So you go dodge that. Number one, number. Yeah. So the um waves are a bit off with their hitboxes. So that's just how the game works. So yeah, sometimes you constantly get hit by them. But you're supposed to be auto healing, but for some reason the game just doesn't want to auto heal me. So yes, he only does three damage to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. Sorry. So basically, when you find you auto heal, but his attacks get a lot harder. So this is just simple, very simple. I might, I might make another video today. Then he's gonna do a bone thing. You hit him. I well that was. So now here, here is a full stop. You gotta do the mercy or fight ending. Alright, so I throw you on the mercy ending, and this will and if you press mercy, he'll give you a badge for it. So, yeah, I'd how long is the video? Only three minutes. So, yeah, that so mercy ending is a badge, and now if you press fight, he will now get a lot harder with his attacks dealing a bit more well, doing dealing one damage, of course, but like that's but his attacks get a lot more frequent, and they um, and there's a lot more. And the bone waves, they get, and the only attack that's been upgraded is that his little bone shooting thing, which actually appears with like 13 bows of bones or something. And that's basically all that's really upgraded. He also stuns gas devices and will be cushions, but they're cook, but they're near the end. So yeah. So now the reason why you have 99 HP and you have the real knife in this, because you are apparently from a for you're from you're from a genocide route, which means that so yep you see that. So he does this, bone 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 bone. I don't know how that hit me. So yes, yeah, some of the attacks are a bit, a bit stupid, but yeah. So as I said, I've tried him before. I've lost because my auto heal got glitched. So there are so there are a few glitches on this fight. Number one is that if you die, but then you auto heal, saves you from death. You cannot auto heal anymore. That's a glitch that I found out the hard way. As I said, I have done this fight before, so I know some of his attacks and how to dodge it. So with the little bone attack, if your um, game is like mine, you always have to go a bit. A bit more of a curve because then you can dodge the attack a bit easier. See, like right here. There we go. Hey, 
and no so basically he now starts changing up his attacks with then now three balloon things a little bone attack and then the gas blaster be careful with the gas blaster because that thing can hit you not e even without the beam it can still hit you because of the gas blaster itself you know you gotta do that So yeah, I'm not going to concentrate because I don't want to lose this. Yes, Sans has a lot of health. Oh, he has a lot of misses. He's got about 30 misses. I have a, I have a feeling that this isn't so. Now that's his new pattern. A few bone waves. Then, a, then the bone shoot. I don't exactly know how slow this knife is, but yeah, I shouldn't have done that. You never go for a double hit, because that can kill you. So that's how you do that attack again. It's glitching, keep running. This place is different. Yeah, see, when he starts saying that line, you've always, you've, you've made half through his first phase. And when and also there's also something cool that can happen near the end. Where apparently there there can be a dog nuke. But it but it rarely appears. With this in mind, I push myself to the absolute limit. See? So that little pink thing right there is, is a whoopee cushion. It slows you down, doesn't do damage. But it's quite annoying if you get hit by it, because you will get hit by it while in attack. Cushion? He has he the reason why I think that this stance isn't a hard boss at all, because his attacks are definitely slower than you would expect them to be. So then what be cushion? You go in, you hit him again. So basically, since I know some of his attacks, I am able to dodge them, but I died uh, near, near like, I was had like one attack away from killing him, or like defeating him, I don't want to kill. So yes, he has a lot of dodges on most of his attacks, but some attacks you can easily get through. So now I think after this swipe, no, maybe, maybe not this swipe. So yeah, you, you cannot double hit him, no matter what. So yes, I even have the power of this world's code. Now he'll do that, he'll do that, and that's all he'll do. Oh, you know, I don't actually know what he does. There's Gasser Blaster, Gasser Blaster, little bone you have to go and hit him here. I don't exactly know what he does, so that's a double hit, but you do take damage for it. Just keep running. Good, and then you hit him. So then that's how that attack works. You get, you get a bone wave in here, turn the thing, then Gasser Blaster, and you hit him. So yes, his final attack is just a five gas of us, I think. I haven't seen it though, so that's just my guess, because that's usually what he does. So there, see, I was able Because... Finally, I'm not the one who got this power. Whoa. Well, see, so yeah, now that's the second, so though... Gotta run, you gotta run, you gotta run. Then, there, there, you gotta, you gotta hit him there. Sometimes the game can start getting a bit on the mess side with some of its moves. With the gas of us sometimes spawning on you, like actually on you. So now here is his second phase. So then he does a bone wave. Bone wave. So yeah, okay. See, you see, they're like... So he's talking about Gasser right there. And right there, I don't know why I try to go in. You should, should always wait, so... A whoopee cushion. So yes. So I don't know if I died on this attack or not, but I definitely died on on an attack soon. Do that. You know, to keep going round. 
like this. All right, so there's so there's another miss. So now, his his attacks change up. This being the tech that I got hit a lot because I didn't know how to get through it without, without taking a lot of damage. Ow. That's what I'm talking about. That, that can sometimes happen. Do not worry though. You will be able to dodge it. You, you okay thankfully this world seems that's what I'm talking about the guys about to can sometimes spawn you if you're not careful so yeah that's the main problem I have with this fight but that's really all that's a mess with this fight I go in, you wait, and then you hit him. So this is gonna probably be just a guide on how to kill him. I won't probably kill him, but I'm trying here. So now I think this is where I died because I tried, you know, hitting him when I when I couldn't. So then I just took a lot of damage. So this is where I died. You just have to keep doing the same thing over and over again. You miss. The most dangerous attack here is that attack. No, any anything else. The guys are slow, and that little bone thing right there is very. It's very slow too. The only problem is, is that that little one. Oh, it's time to get serious here. So I don't exactly know. No more. Alright, so now, this is time to get to the end of the fight, I'm guessing, because of his dialogue. So yes, that's just his attack. Five guys that's in a row. So that is that boss fight for you. There is a guide. I told you how to do the boss fight. His last attack is only five guys of us, and, that, and that's why I thought this video today. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope and I, and I hope this guide helps you. Goodbye now.